welcome back to my channel it's alicia and today i'm going to be doing a hair tutorial kind of thing so i posted a poll on twitter and i asked what you guys would want me to see a braid out or a flexi rod set uh i was actually just about to do my hair and probably like put it in a wig or whatever but i was like okay no i want to try a protective style so i'm gonna try a protective style um and so it looks like the braid out actually won so today we're going to be doing a braid out on my hair i actually have this video on my beauty page which is um something i don't know beauty by alicia or something on instagram and i had shown a while ago a video of me doing my braid out but i thought i would do one on youtube in a little bit more detailed video considering that some of my products have changed um because i'm gonna be trying out a couple new products and then still using a few old products but i'm gonna go ahead and introduce y'all to some of my products so the first one that i like to use is the maui moisture i actually showed this on my um my uh beauty page uh i like to use this this is the curl quench coconut oil curl smoothie and this is for thick curly hair i definitely like to apply this stuff like on my roots and then definitely like at the ends and then the remainder i kind of like you know apply uh to the rest of the thing uh hair or whatever and then I'm going to use this Argan Oil of Morocco. I can't remember if I actually put this in the video or not, but I like to alternate between oils. I had my castor oil that I got from TJ Maxx, um, but I ran out of it. So this is going to be like the next best thing. Uh, and I got this from Walmart too. The Maui Moisture I also got from Walmart too, which both products are very affordable. I have my spray bottle, which just has regular water in it. Eco Styler Gel. Today I'm gonna use the, well, I think this is the Argan, yeah. This is the Argan Oil one. And then I just have like my wide tooth comb, my ratchet brush with all this air in it. And then I have flexi rods to put at the ends. If you have perm rods, I would definitely recommend using those because they're smaller. They can give you like a little bit more defined curl at the bottom. If not, go ahead and use the flexi rod sets. Uh, this is a small, I don't know if this is the smallest one, but this is one of the smallest ones the red kind and i got those from sally beauty now the new products that i'm going to be using are um the daily hair dress and the styling gel from mix chicks okay so the first thing that i'm going to go ahead and do is separate my hair i'm going to go ahead and get um a couple of scrunchies this is not all of the scrunchies that i have there's somewhere else lying around and like my brother got me like this little ring thing that I can like I guess keep up with the scrunchies with I don't know where he got that probably like Target or something just like keep going okay so I'm gonna go ahead and just split my hair in half and this stuff is not detangled at all like this stuff is thick okay so I'm gonna go ahead and take my spray bottle and go ahead and start spraying my roots first because that's where it's like really honestly detangled the most at and then i'm gonna go ahead and take my wide tooth comb first let me actually like section this off a little bit more okay let me go ahead and put this side up too and then we're gonna go ahead and start with this side first now, if I can, um, I think I took some pictures of like what, uh, how much new growth I have. So if I can um, go ahead and like insert them somewhere, I will to show y'all how much new growth I have. It's actually kind of like quite a bit, like it's going, but I'm just like, I needed my hair to be waist length like yesterday. So can we speed up the process, please? Okay but it's actually kind of like growing i've been trying to use a lot of protective styles i've mentioned that like on my beauty page uh, which y'all should definitely go follow on instagram and i think i have one on twitter too that y'all should uh go follow all right i'm gonna go ahead and add the daily hairdress first from mix chicks just a little bit of this and put it all throughout yeah, so I'm just transitioning. I've been trying to use like a lot of protective styles. So I have like a wig. I went to the beauty supply store and got me um, 
like a track to do like a ponytail in. I'll try to like insert all this or whatever. Um, I've done like a bun with the track as well. I've done braid outs and um, I haven't done twist outs just cause I don't know how to do twist outs. I just don't know at all. I'm gonna go with my Maui Moisture now and go ahead and take some of this. And like I said, apply it mainly to like my roots and the ends and then the rest will come in between. Um, but yeah, so I've really been trying to like grow this stuff out. Now I did cut my hair, like I said, back like around graduation time, which was like in May. And I cut it pretty short too. Like I knew I wanted to like transition. So I was definitely transitioning by then, but it definitely wasn't as much as it is like now the progress at least. Um, and, um, I just like, I was like, okay, my hair was, it wasn't long, but it was like a, it was a nice length at least. Um, and then I decided to cut it since I was like, okay, I'm gonna transition anyway. And this way, like I can like get rid of like a bulk of the, uh, relaxed ends at least. So I was like, all right, I'm just going to go ahead and cut it. It was like impulse kind of thing too. I was going to trim my ends. And then um, <laughs> I was on the phone, I think with my brother, I think, or my boyfriend, one of them. And I'm like, I'm gonna just trim my ends or whatever. And then I cut it and it was like a little too high. And I was like, ooh, I shouldn't have done that. So I ran downstairs to my mom and I had somewhere to go that night too. Um, I think it was a grad party. And I was like, mama, like we gotta trim this stuff off or like we gotta cut it or whatever. And I just told her to make it even. And then she made it even. And I was like, uh-uh, just go ahead and cut it. And she's like, you sure? Da -da -da -da. My granny was so devastated because they liked my hair when like it was like a little bit longer and stuff. All right, I'm going to go ahead and open up my Eco Sour Gel. And I'm going to go ahead and use my Mixed Chicks uh, Gel and apply both of them. I'll probably apply this one first just because it's not as thick. And then I'll go ahead and with my uh, Eco Sour Gel. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and take this one first, the Mixed Chicks. And apply it probably about that much i don't know yeah y'all can see the consistency a little bit it's not like it's not too thick to me to me honestly it's about probably the same consistency as this uh black castor flaxseed oil one that's probably why i'm layering it so but y'all this stuff smells so good i'm applying the eco sour gel and i really like coat the roots that way like Everything is slicked, honey. And that stuff can be defined. Okay, so let me show y'all. I don't know if you can see. Let me let me brush this stuff. Hold up. Okay, so I don't know if y'all can see. Cause I guess I didn't really like I guess define it just because I'm trying to moisturize. But that's pretty much like how much new growth I have roughly so you can kind of see the line stops about right there so probably about a good like inch inch and a half all right so now that I've went on ahead and moisturized it and did uh my gel I don't add oil honestly until like I take my stuff down so and the only reason is because it'd be too slippery when I try to braid and now I got these nails so let's pray I can even braid right but I'm just going to go ahead and single braid my hair. Okay, we're going to end it right there. So I got about that much hair left out. And I'm going to take a flexi rod set. And like, I tighten this bad boy up. Like, you got to make this thing tight. Especially because I have short hair too. So I'll be rolling that thing and making it tight. Okay. And like, I'm sure there's like a way that you're supposed to like secure it and stuff like that. But <laughs> I just make mine look like that and call it a day. So I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing for the rest of my hair. And then I'll show you guys some clips, like speed it up a little bit. So I'm not going to talk, probably play some music or whatever, just so you can kind of see what I'm doing.
So I basically went ahead and finished up the rest of my head. Okay, so now I'm just gonna take a little bit of bio silk. Um, you can use any kind of oil or serum that you wanna use. I just like bio silk because it adds a lot of like slip and shine. And I'm just gonna rub it and just kind of put it all throughout my head. Okay. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and put a scarf around my hair just to kind of like uh, lay it down some and flatten it. Um, and that way everything can like stay in place. And then I will come back in the morning and take it down for you guys and show you what the final product looks like.